What's up, Lisa? Why are you crying? Did something happen? I've received a reprimand, Dad. Another reprimand? Why is that? Have you not studied? But this time I've really learned a lot. But Clara tricked me. What did she do? She told Mr. Coons that I had written off. In fact, she wrote off from me. Mr. Coons then gave me a six. And how did the reprimand come about? I then confronted Clara. I wanted her to stop playing games. She recorded the conversation and showed it to the director. The director thinks I'm annoying Clara. That's why she gave me a reprimand. I understand so you've already talked to the director about everything? Yes, I did, but no one believes me. Neither Mr. Coons nor the director. I believe you, Lisa. But I think you need to be very careful. Clara seems to know exactly what she's doing. You can't get reprimand anymore. You've already got two. If you have three referrals, you must leave school. I know, Dad. What should I do now? It's best to keep your feet still. Just try to ignore Clara. Maybe that's when she'll stop. Okay, I'll give it a try. Good morning, Sarah. How are you doing? Is everything okay with you? No, I'm really mad. Is it because of the test? You can always improve your grade. Don't worry too much, Lisa. No, it's not because of the test. It's because of the referral. Did you get another reprimand? Why? Because I threatened Clara. You already have two referrals. You must be careful. What are you going to do now? My dad wants me to keep my feet still. But I don't see it that way. I want to hunt down Clara. Once and for all. How are you going to do that, Lisa? I don't know yet. I need to figure something out quickly. 
before it's too late. Okay, let me know if you need help. Thank you, Lisa. Let's go in so we're not too late. Good morning, dear students. The last test was really tough. Apart from Clara, no one received a good grade. I'd like to give you another chance. You can improve your grade. To do this, you need to create a poster. How do you like the reference, Lisa? You'd better not be too happy, Clara. You said it yourself. He who laughs last laughs best. What are you trying to tell me? Are you trying to threaten me again? Maybe I should record the conversation. And show it to the director. Oh yes, I've already done that ha 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 ha. You have until tomorrow to create the poster. Can I also make a poster, Mr. Coons? Of course, Clara. You can then get another one. All right, do you have any other questions? No? Okay, I'll see you tomorrow then. I wish you a nice day. I'm a bit early. I'm going to get another milk. That's Clara's backpack. I'm sure your poster is in there. I've got an idea. I'm going to destroy Clara's poster. Good morning, dear students. I've already received most of the posters. If you want, you're welcome to give me his. Clara, didn't you want to make a poster too? Yes, Mr. Coons, I made a poster. It's in my backpack. Just wait a minute. I'll give it to you. Mr. Coons, I can't find my poster anywhere. Then I can't give you a one either, Clara. But I did make a poster. It simply disappeared. I don't know how that happened. Where did you leave your backpack, Clara? In this room. Hmm, the door wasn't locked. Someone may have come in. Luckily, we have a camera in the room. We can see what happened. Yes, that's where your backpack is. Someone's coming into the room now. 
Lisa, what are you doing there? Why are you opening Clara's backpack? Oh my God, you're destroying their poster. That's enough now. Lisa, go to the director right away. Hi, Lisa. You're back here. That didn't take long. Hello, Mrs. Director. It's not what it looks like. I can explain that. It's never what it looks like with you, Lisa. You always have excuses and explanations. But the evidence is against you. There's even a video this time. They see you destroying Clara's poster. What is your excuse this time? I already said it last time. It's all part of Clara's plan. She wants to get rid of me. I know it doesn't look like it. But Clara is the bad guy here, not me. It's always the other's fault, Lisa. So you're doing everything right? I'm just trying to fight back. By harming others? I've given you another chance, Lisa. Because I believed in you. Now it's the end of the niceties. You must feel the consequences. I'll give you another reprimand. You must leave our school tomorrow. Hi, Lisa. How do you like the third link? Please leave me alone, Clara. You've won. You've ruined my life. I've told you from the start. You don't have a chance. You shouldn't have messed with me. I knew you were going to destroy my poster. And I knew there was a camera in the room. It was all part of my plan. What else do you want from me, Clara? Just go away and leave me alone. I want to give you a glimpse of the future. I'm going to meet Marcus first. That's when Sarah becomes my best friend. In the end, no one will remember you. It's like you never existed. That's when I achieved my goal.
Do you really have to leave our school, Lisa? Yes, Clara has achieved her goal. I need to change schools. What are you going to do now? Honestly, I don't know. I need to talk to my parents first. Then I hope that another school will accept me. Although I have three references. Is there anything else we can do? Perhaps we can talk to Mr. Coons. Or with the director. Sarah, please. I don't want any of you getting into trouble. It only makes things worse. I'm really going to miss you, Lisa. I know I've made a lot of mistakes. But you're still very important to me, Lisa. Thank you, Marcus. I don't want you to go, Lisa. I don't want to go either, Stefan. But Lisa, that can't be the end. I'm so sorry, Sarah. But that is really the end. When does Lisa have to leave school? A. Tomorrow. B. Exaggerate. C. In one week. Write a comment.